Yeah! Handsome sausage. What's the feelings with handsome sausages? Hello everybody, we have some sausages and today we're reacting to Extraordinary Heroes Come Into My Head. Mm. This is finally the new album. Oh, yes, Deadlock, yes. That everybody has yes. been talking about. This is the first track. We're going to listen to the uh, lyrics video so we can follow mm. along. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's like different uh, versions of it, like live stage and all that. Uh -huh. We'll get to that uh, down the road if a lot of you want us to do it. But for now, we're going to check out the original mm. uh, track for this. Usually, you know, we used to do a lot of live videos as our initial reaction because it's external heroes. But for this uh, album, I thought, hey, maybe we should try the good quality official audio first and then get to live performances where applicable. So we're going to do that. And before we start, thank you everybody who's supporting our channel over at our Patreon page. If you want to have a say in what we react to next, get extra contents and all those lovely stuff, check out our Patreon page. The link is in the description below. Let's get to the song. Three, two, one, click. Is that the old... The number you have found is not wow. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Oh. It's like almost metal-ish. Oh. Oh. Yay. Let's go. Hey. Very like. Hey. Love that. And this is Trion! Wow, it's like very fusion-esque. You're yeah. the best? Wow! Oh, nice! Provision. Oh, and then into like this rock sound. It started off like very industrial as well. Yeah! I like the shouting at the back. Yeah! Mm, yeah, it's very like spooky and industrial too. Everything is so metallic. I can stop thinking about you. That's how. How do you rap this while playing drum? Oh, it was my bad, my bad. It was. It was I thought it was going. That build up. Love this shout. Wow, the, the twists and turns of this music is so many unexpected turns. Fusion esque sound again. Build up. Oh, that scream! Yay! Yeah, that, that. That is so unique. Oh, this music was fun! Wow! Dang, Exodary Heroes. They did, did themselves. Did Exodary Heroes yeah. again. Wow. wow. It feels like as we go through the album, the crazier their music gets. Yeah. Like now we really see what kind of color they are. You know, ever since, like, I think the turning point for me was Tamkore. Mm -mm -mm. That's when I was like, they got something really yeah, yeah. special here. They're not just another 
rock band mm-hmm. from Korea. They they do a lot of fusion shit too. Yeah. You know? Like they mix like even here like you said like oh it kind of starts off metallic, like a metal sound. But uh, I'm sorry, I said metallic as in literally metal like metal sound. Mm-hmm. He meant like metal. It's a yeah, genre, yeah. but I thought it's more like a fusion between like a modern, almost like a like a electro music mm-hmm. slash. There's this rock sound, and yep. then there's like hints of different genres mm-hmm. here and there. And again, it was very industrial. It was very experimental. Yeah, you know, we started off saying that oh, Extraordinary Hero is very experimental mm. in that they deviate from the typical K-pop not like an experimental music yeah, yeah. but they are getting closer and closer to that realm mm-hmm. not yet of course but they actually do way more experimental things like legit they use different sounds mm-hmm. they use different sources they start off with this like phone dial like almost like an old like modem sound you know like that yeah, internet, yeah, yeah, yeah. internet ring sound and they play around with different sources and sounds and the best part is if you listen to them live they actually pull that off live they actually create and play with those sounds live mm-hmm. as a band and that's where my respect to extraordinary heroes is at like at its peak i think they're wonderful first of all i want to apologize that while it was the counts part I said like how do you rap like that while playing drum then I was, I was like, like thinking to myself like I was playing drum with the, the audio and then I was just reading the lyrics and by top of it I just went up a little bit I saw G I thought that was Kanil uh, so it, and the top of it like it was like playing drums so I was like wow whoa, like how do you do that but then I just realized it wasn't Kanil so I was like oh shit my bad <laughs> that aside the, the previous albums tend to have very experimental like structure wise and the placement of the music patterns and instruments while this one was more like a sound wise and how you use that sound <laughs> i could say but structure wise and music song form and everything i if, really find it very poppy so it's very easy to catch and easy listening mm-hmm. compared to other that are going like crazy on your ears and everything right but this one was very fun and bouncy yeah. on your ears but i could say a little bit of conventional fun type of rock mm-hmm. because they used a lot of like you know 808 and a lot of electronica mm-hmm. music elements the verse and the second verse was completely different yeah yeah and having fun of the rhythms like let's say the verse was going this the chorus going like half beat you know like right right so so those kind of stuff it's never boring on your years right it's, it's right. It, there's always something coming and yeah for sure uh, they they do definitely play a lot with rhythms mm-hmm. like them being self-writing like band uh it really gives them this advantage when it comes to playing musically with different mm-hmm. things so like while it is easy going and like easy on your ears so to speak uh, there's definitely still a lot of uh, elements there musically that they do that are very impressive and you know in the middle too like every chorus like the way it ends and the way the beat kind of comes in unexpectedly in a different like almost like a t- different time signature mm-hmm. or something like they them playing with the rhythm then playing with the beat it, it catches you off guard if you're used to certain things and if you're looking for certain things like like we do we have certain expectations and you know you listen to it and you go whoa what did mm. they just do and even the chord progression right mm. you like the way things go up and yeah, up and up yeah and, yeah so like that kind of things it's still always so like tasty almost mm. uh, when they do it and that this being the first track where they're like inviting you into their headspace basically it's such a wild it's such a wild opening to an album and you know i i can't imagine I what the rest it. of the tracks are gonna be yeah. especially since every one of you has mentioned that this album is crazy yeah so very very excited it's like almost as crazy as how we felt when we first heard z as like the oh. opening track although i think z is like it's i, I have a bias for z i think it's like one of the best things ever but anyways, you for know, me, I think it's gonna be this one. Maybe, like, maybe I had so much fun with like this. Like it might be, it might be, yeah. It, like it's gonna be a wild ride, and we're here for it. So hope you, hope you definitely enjoy this as well. And yeah, we're gonna go through this album now. Ooh, let's go! Can't let's wait! Go. Can't wait! Yeah. So we'll see you in the next track. Stay safe, warm. Bye bye. Coming to sausages. Hey. Bug. XJ. 
Leticia Pacheco. Moon. Yagmur Cascan. AC. Gilliam Castellanos. Sleepy Bat. Stefani White. Winnie Chu. Megan. Tachi. Young Man. Annette Matthews. Sakura X. Misty Dawson. Lily 450. Groupies. Jane. Samira Rodriguez. Kira Crepey. 